Mandalorian trailer uh, came out, and also uh, Angry Birds 2 doing good in the theaters. That will be up next on SMN. <laughs> hey guys, I'm Sam Ravine. This is week uh, 41 of SMN, and uh, I was back at school this week starting on Wednesday, and so that's why there was uh, 3.30 videos instead of uh, 12.45 or 12.30. So, yeah, I'll be back in the school schedule, I call it. Um, so yeah, 3.30 on the weekdays, and then 12.30 on the... Uh, on the weekends, besides 9 o'clock for us men, which is now, so, yeah. So, so, um, movies that are doing good right now, I guess. Uh, there's Blinded by the Light. It's doing better than suspected. Still not that good, but, you know, you got Hobbs and Shaw then. And then, uh, the Angry Birds too, Doing pretty good, so, yeah. And then the movie news right now. Big one. Mandalorian trailer. Came out. Um, I, I went to a Star Wars celebration to check, um, about the Mandalorian panel, and I saw it there, so I already knew what this show was kind of going to be about. It, yeah, it was going to be kind of, it was going to be kind of darker than, um, most Star Wars stuff. And then, um, yeah, that's really it, I guess. It looked kind of like a classic, uh, like, uh, I look kind of like a classic uh, spaghetti western, what Lucas was going for. And when I saw Solo, I enjoyed that, too, because it kind of seemed like uh, The Good, The Bad, The Ugly a little bit, although I haven't seen that movie. But, you know, kind of seemed like that a little bit. And so, yeah. And then, um... Yeah, so The Mandalorian trailer was cool. Check that out if you haven't seen it. And then there's the big Spider-Man news this weekend. Or this week. Saturday, or on uh, Sunday, uh, Disney walked into Sony saying they want to multiply their, uh... Their, it's like 5% or something. I forgot what it was. But Disney gets 100% of merchandise, I think it was, but they, and then so and then Sony gets 95% or whatever this was, and Disney was getting 5% of that, so then they just walk in and say, we want 10, 10 multiply that by 10, we want 50% instead of 5%, so Sony said, get out and stuff. So yeah, now, now Disney um, lost Spider-Man, and my opinion is, I think it's Disney's fault, not Sony's. Because people love merchandise and like, sure they could have raised it up to like fifteen or twenty, and they, I bet they might have said yes for twenty, maybe, maybe even up to thirty. But like fifty, that's just crazy. You go up by forty five percent, and then, uh, and then uh, there is also some rumors though of uh, Disney getting uh, getting uh, Spider Man for a couple more movies to finish him off, and he probably will die. Oof. But then um. Or there's the rumors of Sony continuing their own Spider-Man thing. Uh, and crossing over with Venom and not having to deal with a bunch of other stuff. Which, it was kind of annoying. Like, they would they would get Joe, Jonah, Joe, Jonah Jameson. J.K. Simmons. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure they'll be able, able to use them. They won't be able to use John Favre Girl. Aunt May, though, would be able to use, be able to use uh, Venom, obviously. So Venom might be the villain in the next one. Or they might just have a classic, like, or, like, um, Spider-Man 2, kind of, just without. Or they could just use Spider-Man 2. Hmm. But, yeah. So who knows what's going to happen. And then the uh, movie of the week, Mr. Smith Goes to Washington. I'll be reviewing that movie this week, so look, uh, look out for that. And then uh, movies I want to see, Blinded by the Light, um... I would want to see this in the theaters. Um, Angry Birds 2, though, I can care to see in the theaters. I can wait till it's on DVD, because I could care to see it now. But, you know, if I would, if I could, because my brother might want to see it. So we might go out to see it, but, yeah. So, Blinded by the Light, though, I want to check out. So that's week 41 of SMN, and, uh, yeah, see you next time, my fans.